Good morning, divas. Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be incorporating this derma sheet mask with tea tree into my skincare routine. This is from a company called Labco. So I have done other sheet mask videos before. So if you get a chance, definitely check those out. Uh, we're gonna try this out and I will give you my review after I've applied it. And I'll give you a few specs about it as well as I'm going through the process of putting it on and, and whatnot. So you'll get a chance to see that. But before I get started with the video, let me just introduce myself to anybody who's new to my channel. I am Simply Perry, and I do health, beauty, lifestyle vlogging. If you are interested in knowing a little bit more about this tea tree mask and what the ingredients are, or how to probably make your skin feel, then stick around to the end and definitely check out my review at the end, okay? All right, so let's go ahead and get started. Okay, the first thing you want to do is wash and exfoliate your skin. I'm using Truffle Therapy Whipped Cleansing Cream by Skin & Company and a facial cleansing buff to exfoliate. Don't forget your neck because the remaining essence will be used for your neck. I actually forgot that step and had to take a shower while I was waiting uh, with the mask on. All right, now you want to open the package and take the mask out. The excess liquid that you see will be used for your neck. Now, be careful not to tear the mask while opening it. It's made with natural fibers and it's super thin and can possibly rip if you're not careful. When applying the mask, don't forget to pull the flap down for the nose. Then gently apply the mask to your face, making sure to lay the sheet down and smooth it out. I like to start from the top and work my way down. Now, two ingredients in this mask are tea tree, which is beneficial for pore cleansing, and Althea Rosia flower extract. Both ingredients are for inflammation, redness, and soothing the skin. Now, once you're done, you can sit back and relax for about 10 to 20 minutes. I left my mask on for 20 minutes and now I'm going to remove the mask and pat the remaining essence into my skin. Then I'll apply any remaining essence that's left in the pouch to my neck and chest area. So my 20 minutes is up. I've taken the mask off and let me give you my review of the tea tree derma sheet mask. Okay, so first let's talk about the smell. I really liked the idea that it does not have a really strong smell of tea tree. In fact, I did not smell tea tree yeah, I didn't smell it at all, which was really shocking because when I first saw tea tree on this, I said, oh my God, that's gonna make me sick. <laughs> I don't like the smell. The second thing is, it. I, I did like the essence. It's lightweight, it feels comfortable. Now that I've taken it off, it just feels like it's soaking into my skin and giving me that extra moisture that I needed. It doesn't feel too heavy and weighed down. It's summertime and I do not want to feel like I have oily skin. So between the smell and the lightweight the feel of the essence, I really love this product. So where can you get this? You can get it at labcoastusa.com. They come in packs of five uh, for $17 and you can get a single sheet for $4. So overall, I really like this product. My recommendation is to definitely check out the company. I do like this company. I have used their mask before and I've had good results. So guys, if you stuck around and you enjoyed this 
and you have not subscribed to my channel yet, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Definitely don't forget to hit the notification bell. Give me a thumbs up if you liked my video. And if you'd like to see more content like this or other things, leave something in the comments for me and I will definitely try my best to do that. All right, so um, thank you guys so much for watching my channel and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.